When I was five, my father was not well. And the hospital said they feel they need to operate on him. But to operate on him, it's very possible they'll leave him as a vegetable. One of the people who went through the war with my father, whose name was Rabbi Srorodzinski, said such a question it ought to be put to a God will be a strong. He sent 23 letters to all Gedolim across the world. He got one reply. The Lubavitch Rebbe replied that he has it from Kabbalah, from his ancestors, that one who says chitas sees a Yeshua. So Rabbi Yisrael said, I decided to call the Rebbe directly. And he said, we've received your letter, but um, the man is too ill to do chitas. So he said, well, let his mishpocha do it for him. He says, unfortunately, he's lost all his mishpocha in the war. He has no one. So he said, well, let a friend do chitas for him. And Rabbi Saul was not an Babi Shachoset. And uh, he started doing chitas. After six weeks, they saw a marked improvement. After another six weeks, they did release him. Baruch Hashem, he was fine. 